I'm going to be bringing you a quick video today on how to make your own, well not make your own, but get any custom screensaver off the internet and apply it to your actual computer, all using a downloaded image from the internet, such as this Battlefield for China Rising image that I've got here. Now for the first thing what you want to do is you want to download one, I've actually got one on my file on my computer just here, it's the Razer Frag PC one, but if you want to download this specific one, the link will be in the description, you go to Razer Game Mode game zone this actual website here and you want to click this and it'll be here and you want to click download PC now you it'll come up in a zip file if you don't have WinRAR it'll actually come up as in your Windows Explorer I'm using Windows 8.1 just recently gone from Windows 8 and it seems to be quite alright it'll come up as this one extract the file out by either dragging and dropping or I'm pretty sure you can click right click on here and click extract all and then it'll say what you want to do it. But if you've got a WinRAR file, pretty much the same, just open it up and drag and drop it onto your main screen. From doing this now, what you want to do is you want to pick up the file, drag it into a place where you can. Now, if you double click on it, it'll, it'll come up with the little image and then blank off if you move your thing. You can click configure, it'll say there's no screensaver settings for this file. What you want to do is you want to click install. Once you click install, it'll come up with this thing and it'll ask you for what the wait time is. I'm going to take my time to 10 minutes. Now you can change this to any time that you absolutely want to whatsoever, and that's pretty much how you do it. It should do this, this little play button should come up for anything with a screensaver or a .scr file. I'm pretty sure you can put dog .gifs to it, but that I might do another video on that later on. Now onto the part where you can put your own images onto this file. Now you want to create your own folder for this, uh, which contains all your screensaver files. I'm going to type in screensaver photos now and drag and drop this China Rising photo inside that. Now you want to go to the same program by going into type in screensaver onto the side of this. This should work if you go into the bottom left and type in search down in the bottom for Windows 7. You want to click change screensaver it will come up with this. Now if you click photos there are a load of others as well. If you click photos unlike if you click mystify and then click settings it will say this is screensaver has no options that you can set. If you click photos and click settings you can then browse and see what else you, the other documents that are on here. So if you go down, you can find any uh, thing I want, screensaver photos, you can click OK, save, and it'll come up with the only photo that you've got. Then you want to click apply and OK. You can add other various photos into here that you want as your screensaver. You can set them to shuffle or non shuffle and other options. There's also other help on, I'm sure if you Google it. But I've, I made this video purely because the other day I was looking to set a screensaver and I had some real problems finding out how to do it on my own. There wasn't many videos on YouTube and through sifting through pages and pages of Google finally find out how to do it. So, I just thought I'd bring this video to you. Thanks for watching guys, I'd appreciate a like, comment, anything that will help me in the future, and uh, I'll see you next time.